Well, a new political leader in the South Bay also has a list of priorities. He is the youngest state legislator in 80 years. Please welcome 25 year old Alex Lee, representing District 25 in the State Assembly. I should say, Assembly member elect Alex Lee. Nice to have you on the program. That has a nice ring to it. Has it sunk in for you? <laughs> well, pleasure to be here. And it definitely is very surreal right now, but it's a whirlwind of excitement from our side on the campaign as we get ready to take office in just less than a month, too. Yeah, you put a lot of work into that campaign and it definitely paid off. Congratulations. Now, do you feel a lot of pressure in this new role? People think, oh, he's 25 years old, <laughs> maybe too young to be taken seriously. Look, there's always going to be people who doubt us, even since on the campaign we were doubted and we're an underdog in the campaign. But it's our job and it's my job in office to prove all those doubters wrong by working 10 times as hard for my constituency. So that's a challenge I'm ready to take on. Well, you're actually not new to politics. You worked for Assemblyman yeah. Evan Lowe. You worked at the state capitol. You were student body president at UC <laughs> Davis. Uh, so you have a lot of experience. Have you always wanted to get into politics? You know, it's not something I always imagined myself doing. Back in 2012, just eight years ago, when President Barack Obama was campaigning for his re-election, that was when I was applying to colleges. And, you know, when an 18, 17-year-old is figuring out what to do with their life, and like someone like me who wanted to make an impact in society, I figured politics was probably a stronger bet than uh, filmmaking. So that's what I stuck to studying. And then I became student body president at Davis. And right after college, I went to work in the state capitol, writing and passing bills. And now I'm going to use those same skills to represent my home district right here in the Bay Area. Now, what are, what are be, uh, what's going to be on your agenda once you take office? Yeah, yeah. Well, on December 7th, the day I'm sworn in, we are going to introduce a bill to get corporate money out of politics. Uh, we are going to introduce a bill that prohibits corporate contributions directly to candidates, just like uh, state candidates, just like it is in the federal races. And we're also going to put in a publicly financed election system to make sure that corporations don't have an outsized influence in our democracy, but the people have true power in our democracy. Okay, let's talk about your um, your bedroom. This is your mom's house. You you <laughs> also say affordable yeah. housing. The housing crisis is yeah. also a priority. Many of us, many people, still living with their family because we just know how tough it is to live in the Bay Area. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so this is the bedroom that I went to high school in. It's my childhood bedroom uh, and, you know, still remains to be my bedroom for years to come. Um, yeah, the affordable housing crisis affects everyone within my district in, in the Bay Area and, you know, probably across California, right? Whether you're a young professional like myself who only economically it makes sense to live at home because you're, you have the privilege and you're lucky enough to do so, or you're thinking about moving away to a whole state entirely. That's why the housing crisis, I think, is the number one issue that's pressing on so many people's minds, especially as we have the pandemic-induced recession right now, where so many people are at risk of losing their homes. So housing affordability and the housing crisis remain, remain my top priority. Assembly member elect Alex Lee, so nice to have you on the program. You have energized uh, me and so many uh, young people out there. We look forward to all the work that you're going to do at the state capitol and hope to talk to you soon. Well, thank you so much. Thanks. Congratulations. Janelle, did he say 25 years old? Wow. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> These people overachieve so much. It's just so natural for them and uh, very impressive. He's an impressive young man. Let's